and kids get connected. Today we're starting our Christmas series. Woo! And we're looking at the wise men and how we can learn from them about how we are to seek Jesus. Let's go. Let's pray. Holy Spirit, we thank you. We thank you for bringing us all together and we welcome you here with us today. We pray that you prepare our hearts ready to receive something new today. Father God, I pray for each and every person here right now. I want you, Heavenly Father, to just pour out your love on them. Pour out your love on them, I pray, as they receive from you today. We thank you for this service. We thank you for all that you have prepared for us to learn today. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. Oh, hello everyone. I am going to read uh, Matthew 2, verse 1 to 12. After Jesus was born in Bethlehem in Judea during the time of King Herod, Magi from the east came to Jerusalem and asked, Where is the one who has been born King of the Jews? We saw his star in the east and have come to worship him. When King Herod heard, he was disturbed and all Jerusalem with him. When he had called together all the people's chief priests and teachers of the law, he asked them where Christ was to be born. In Bethlehem, in Judea, they replied, for this is what the prophet has written. But you, Bethlehem, in the land of Judah, are by no means least among the rulers of Judah. Out of you will come a ruler who will be the shepherd of my people Israel. Then Herod called the Magi secretly and found out from them the exact time the star had appeared. He sent them to Bethlehem and said, Go and make a careful search for the child. As soon as you find him, report to me so that I too may go and worship him. After they had heard the king, they went on their way, and the star they had seen in the east went ahead of them until it stopped over the place where the child was. When they saw the star, they were overjoyed. On coming to the house, they saw the child with his mother Mary, and they bowed down and worshipped him. Then they opened their treasures and presented him with the gifts of gold and incense and of men. And having been warned in a dream not to go back to Herod, they returned to their country by another route. So I have two questions for you. Which city was Jesus born in? Which city was Jesus born in? That's one question. And the second question is, who showed the Magi's where baby Jesus was? Who showed the Magi's where baby Jesus was? So if you know the answers, write down your answers. If you have somebody with you, discuss amongst yourself um, the answers that you have and compare. And children, if you have an adult with you, ask them and see if they knew the answers.
thank you for today and thank you for that we were able to spend time together and worship God in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. one to eat all their cookies. Yum, 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 yum. And your time starts now. Woo, woo, woo. That's it, on your forehead and you've got to work it down your face. If it drops on the floor, then you have to start again at your forehead. You cannot use your hands to get your cookie to your mouth. Can you use your mouth to go to Remember, Kingdom Kids, down to you. You decide who the winner is. Are you Team 19 or are you Team 82? Let's see if they can eat all their cookies in the two minutes that they've got. They've got to try and get it down their face without using their hands. It's a tricky one, but it has been done, so it can be done 1982. Keep going. Oh, dear. <laughs> this is so Remember Kingdom Kids, share with us who are you supporting? Are you Team 19 or are you Team 82? Have you tried this the one at home? Help us and let us know. Keep going 1982, retrieve your cookies and start again. Let's see if we can at least get one. We've only got under one minute left now. Oh, We're coming to 50 on. seconds and we haven't had no cookies eaten yet. Come on 1982, <laughs> can we at least do one? <laughs> Come on, kids and kids! I'm gonna be Get sharing. Which team are you? 19 or 82? We've only got 30 seconds left, Kingdom Kids. Oh! They're gonna count down when we get to five. But let's hey. see. How are you gonna get this done, 1982? You've got 20 ah. seconds left now. Keep going. I love Oreo, um, uh, Oreo cookies. That's the ones we're using today. Which cookies have you used for this challenge? Come on, 1982. Can we get at least one cookie done? And we got five, four, three, two, one. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh no! I think you can say that was team 82 because 19. Oh. Wow. Oh dear, that was very hard. Wow. 82. That was very difficult. I thought it was coming out. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, 1982. No, that was 82. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. Well, number 19. Um, anyway, winners. 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 Kingdom Kids. You just. <laughs> Okay, it's time for our cable tie. 
and our cable tie today comes from Deuteronomy chapter 4 verse 29. Have you got your Bible? If you've got your Bible, see if you can find it. Deuteronomy chapter 4 verse 29 and I'm going to read it now from the Bible. But if from there you seek the Lord your God, you will find him if you seek him with all your heart and with all your soul. Amen. Deuteronomy chapter 4, 29. To help me today, I've brought my binoculars. Now you might not have a pair of binoculars, but what you can do is you can make a pair like this. And we're going to seek God as we read our cable tie. And we're going to use all our heart and all our soul. Are you ready? I'm going to read it with my binoculars now. Deuteronomy 4 verse 29. But if from there you seek the Lord your God, you will find him if you seek him with all your heart and with all your soul. Deuteronomy 4, 29. And this is me using all that I have, everything at my disposable that I can have to seek the Lord my God. And I'm gonna seek him through reading his word, through praying for him, to him and searching for him in all areas of my life. So don't forget, you must seek the Lord with all your heart and with all your soul. Come and see to worship, come and see to worship, come and see to worship, come and see to worship. Wise men came from far away, little baby Jesus in a manger lay. Come and see to worship, come and see to worship, come and see to worship, come and see to worship. Just to see him would make their day. All they need was to know the way. Come and see to worship, come and see to worship, come and see to worship, come and see to worship. Led by the star when they came from afar. Heard he was worried, wondering who am I? Secretly thinking the little one must die. Come and see to worship, 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 come and see to worship. I'll trick them to reveal when they see him as they kneel. I say I'm going to worship him. That'll be the deal. Come and see to worship, come and see to worship, come and see to worship, come and see to worship. Finally they saw him, offered him their praise, laid their gifts before him, then holy hands they raised. Come and see to worship. Come and see to worship, 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 come and see to worship. Rejoicing with great joy, because they've seen the little boy. What they heard the angels say, they returned another way. Come and see to worship, come and see to worship, come and see to worship, come and see to worship. They came and saw and worshipped. Kingdom Kids, what do you do when you hear good news? Do you get excited, go and see the person, congratulate them, or keep quiet? Well, for me, when I hear about good news, I get excited and I want to find out a lot more. So I would go and search for information. Well, I have good news story for you from the Bible and it is all about three wise men who heard about the birth of Jesus and they were so excited to hear that they decided to find out for themselves what this good news was all about. So they set out on a journey in search for the baby Jesus. They did everything they could to find the baby Jesus because they wanted to see him and to worship him and to give him their gifts. It took them a long time, but they never gave up. When they found him, they worshiped him and presented him with their best gifts. There is so much we can learn from these wise men. They heard the news and they went searching looking and asking questions. Are you looking for Jesus? Are you asking questions? Do you want to worship him? We too 
can find Jesus if we seek him. Search for him, read his words, listen to his teaching, and obey him. Jesus said we will find him when we seek him. The wise men worship him when they found him. Jesus desires our praise, worship, and our adoration. We should give him honor and always give him our best gifts. We should look for Jesus in everything we do. Give him the best of what we have. Spending time in his word, sharing time with God's people, going to church, using our gifts to build the body of Christ. The wise men gave gifts. God has given us gifts. We too can use our gifts to serve the Lord, such as using our voices to sing praises to the Lord, share some of our pocket money by giving an offering. Remember, Jesus is the reason for Christmas and it is time for you to seek him. The best gift you can give this Christmas is to give your heart to the Lord. If the Lord is speaking to you, to speak to someone who will help you to find Jesus. Amen. Are you ready to pray? Let's pray together right now. Your prayers are precious to God. They are gifts to him. He wants to hear your voice. So we're all going to pray together. And I've got our prayer points here for us today. We're going to pray thanking God for sending Jesus. We're going to pray that we seek Jesus with all that we have. We seek him always, not only at Christmas. We're going to pray that the Holy Spirit will help us to help others find Jesus and that we worship God with all that we have. Are you ready? Let's pray together right now. Father God, we thank you. We thank you for sending your son Jesus, that precious gift for each and every one of us. We thank you, God, for sending him to save us, Heavenly Father. And we pray, Almighty God, that we seek Jesus in all areas of our lives, every day, not just at this time of year when we remember to celebrate, but at all times throughout every part of our lives, Heavenly Father. May we seek him at school. May we seek him when we're, at, we're amongst our friends. May we seek him when we're uh, in the community. May we seek him because we know, Heavenly Father, that we will find him everywhere we go. And we pray, Heavenly Father, that you will help us, Holy Spirit, help us to help others find Jesus because you sent your precious son for everyone. And we want everyone to find him, Lord. So help us to help others. And we pray, Almighty God, that we worship you. We worship you with everything that we have. May we worship you with our time. May we worship you with our gifts. May we worship you with all that you have blessed us with, Lord. We thank you, God, for Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we pray, amen. Okay, 1982, are you ready for this challenge? No! <laughs> this is a Kingdom Finds game, and you've just got to keep going until you have found all the boiled eggs. Do you understand 1982? Yes. And the way to find the boiled eggs is by picking one and cracking it on your opponent's head. And we keep going till we found all the boiled eggs. Oh. Are you ready? <laughs> no. I have one question. Uh, <laughs> How many of them are, um, oh, we're not gonna, we're just, Wow. I don't know 1982. Are you, you ready, Sister Lee? You are. <laughs> I do not know 1982. I cannot help you with that question, but what I do know is you are blessed because there is no time limit. You can just keep going until you found all the boiled eggs. Are you ready, 1982? And 
and we're going to start with 19. 19 is going to select the egg and crack it on 82 and keep going. Don't wait for me. Keep going until we've found all the boiled eggs. Ready? Ah, ah, ah! Off we go, 1982. Oh. Off we go! Remember Kingdom Kids, this is a Kingdom Fine game and we're trying to find all the boiled eggs. And when we found a boiled egg, there's, there's a point for the team. Okay, that's a boiled egg, 19. Right, 82, your time is next. Your turn next. Let's keep this going. And here's 82, selecting the egg, and off she goes. One, two, three, go, 19. Okay, look. Put your hand on. That one is not a boiled egg, everyone. Keep going. 19's turn. Off you go, 19. And are you ready, 82? So far, 19 is doing okay and 82 let's see how you are doing ready <laughs> remember kingdom kids keep cheering keep supporting your team are you team 19 or are you team 82 <laughs> Have a look, Kingdom <laughs> Last egg of the challenge. Are you ready, 82? Stop aiming! Are you ready, 90? Come, come, come closer, Are you ready, Sorry. Kingdom Kids? No. Oh, 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 and there's a Kingdom Find! Oh. Well, well, number 90! 82, oh. you're going to 19. God bless you. For um, the challenge. Oh God. Before you get any funny ideas. Um, vote 82. Vote number 19. 
Monday! 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 This challenge is called Kingdom Whisk and we want to see who can whisk their egg whites the quickest and we're going to give you three minutes and at the end of the three minutes you have to hold your bowl over your head to ensure that your white egg whites have been whisked. Are you ready 1982? Yay! Yay! Do you understand the challenge? Yes! Okay you've got a full three minutes so please use them wisely. 
and your time starts now. Okay, Kingdom Kids, they've got to keep whisking and whisking and whisking their egg whites and they want to get them nice and firm because when they hold that bowl over their head, they don't want any egg whites to fall out. But they have to keep whisking. This is a hard challenge. Who's good at baking? Who's good at whisking? Who's whisking egg whites? I'm doing it and I'm not. Share with us. Let's see who you're supporting and how well you could do this challenge yourself at home. They've got a full three minutes. Keep going, 1982. Are they allowed to change hands? Yes, why not? They can change hands. Remember, Kingdom Kids, it's all down to you. You decide who the winner is. At the end of the three minutes, Kingdom Kids, they're going to hold the bowl over their head. <laughs> Who has whisked their head? Keep cheering, keep supporting. Come on, 1982 needs to hear us. Um, our support, Kingdom Kids. And they've <laughs> gone halfway. Keep going, 1982. This is an amazing challenge. The egg whites are fluffing up, Kingdom Kids. Keep supporting, keep cheering. 1982, keep going. Come on, you guys. Cheer 82, please. I need all the help I can get. All the help I can get. Wow. Oh, yours is going. It's painful, you know. Oh. <laughs> this is difficult. What's the timer? And you have just over a minute left. Oh. And we're This is your final stretch. Come on, 1982. Oh, Keep whisking those egg whites. We want to see who's got nice uh, egg whites that will not fall out on their heads after this three, after these three minutes. Come on, Kingdom Kids. Keep supporting. Keep cheering. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. 19 or 82. It's all down to you. You decide. They're doing amazing. This is difficult. And we're at our last 30 uh, seconds in no, three, no, no, two, no, 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 one. Are you 19 or are you 82? Woo! Hey! I thought this meringue business was easy, you know. You know when you watch and you say, hey, you said this thing look easy. But it's not easy. It's not easy. <laughs> who the winner is. No, 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 Guys, it's not ready, so therefore... I think we need another two minutes. <laughs> it's not ready, two guys, minutes. so you can vote number <laughs> 19, which is not ready. You see, I believe that it was easier. I thought it was going to be easier. So guys, if I... If I tip this upside down, it's clearly going to go all over me. <laughs> so I've clearly lost the challenge. So, do you think I need to tip it over my it head? It's evident. It's evident. I isn't think it? not. What do you think? Vote number 19. Guys, vote 82. Come on, please. Please. Um, yeah, it's definitely not ready, guys. Look, look at this. It's not ready. So, clearly, if I go up. Ah, I don't think so, not this time. 20 minutes later, <laughs> and we have victory! Yay! Woo! Show the doors, Em. Yay! So, here we go. One, two, three. Okay, three, two, one. Yeah, I think the one you started to. Three, two, one, eh? Yeah. Three, two, one. 